Welcome back to the channel. It is the baddest man on the planet, the human juggernaut himself, Damien McLeod. Now, everyone wants my opinion on the Omar Isoff video with where he collabed with um, Elena, I mean, Alpha Destiny, my bad, Alpha Destiny. Now, <laughs> let's say this. I watched the Blah Hop video. I didn't even watch the Omar and Alpha video because I don't even care for that fraudulent shit. I don't care. But going off of what um, Blaha, aka um, the fake Merc, is saying is that this, look. Alpha Destiny can't even bitch 315. According to Blaha, Alpha Destiny I guess he said his bench press is maxed around 285. Like, what the fuck? Like, I'm not even at my most optimal. I can go in and throw up 285 a couple reps. You know what I'm saying? With a hurt shoulder, I was throwing that shit up. I threw up like, what, 300 for a single. And I had that fucking ping in the back of my left delt. <laughs> and I think that actually made my shit worse. Because, you know, when you're the lowering of the weight, you're still using your back to, you know, help stabilize that shit. That shit hurt. But anyway, you know, you know I'm a beast. You know, I, you know, you already know my bitch presence is maximum, maximum effort. But anyway, yeah, so, you know, according to, uh, you know, blah, uh, Destiny can't even hit 315 on the bench. That's crazy. That's crazy. Shit. I wonder what I can hit right now. I haven't hit the bench press in one, two, three, four months? Shit, gonna be like four months. But I'm gonna get right back into it because I'm a natural. So when you're a natural, you don't need to take any drugs. You don't need to do any extracurricular bullshit. You just gotta make sure you're eating and carving up. I'm actually cutting the calories back slightly because I'm in a very, very slow cut. Because normally when I do a cut, like I knock that shit off in like three weeks. I like I'll knock off like a shitload of weight and be fucking ripped. But I'm tired of starving and shit. I want to know I'm easing back on the calories so that way it's like a healthy way. So, you, so that way you won't go and binge. Like I might have a day, maybe this week sometime, where I'm gonna just do like a crazy ass low calorie day. But I'm really not making it a bunch of days like that. Just slowly cutting back on the calories, slowly cutting the body fat down, and I can see it's going a lot slower than normal. But you know, it is what it is. But the video is not about my cut. The video is about, you know, Omar Us Elsoff, you know, training with Alpha Destiny. Now, people, you know, you're not asking me my opinion because you care about how much he bench presses or how strong he is. It's all about the fact that a lot of people out there think that Alpha Destiny is a fake natty. And if he is a fake natty, what would a person like Omar Esoff be doing filming a video with Alpha Destiny? Now you know I'm gonna I'm not gonna bullshit. No no um no what do you call that shit? No pussy footing it around here. I'm just gonna keep I'm saying like it is. You know what I'm saying? It's for the subs. I mean I don't think Omar is on stuff. He might have been at one time, who knows? Who knows? I don't watch him enough like that, but from what I saw, he looked like he he was one of the regular guys who just went in and lifted. And didn't take shit. Now, if he actually, you know, I don't know his personal history. I'm not going to say he ever did. But my opinion, I actually think Omar is natural. You know what I'm saying? Now, with that said, why would a natural person who is, you know, giving good advice, he has damn good advice. Not going to bash the guy at all. He gets solid advice. He knows a lot of shit. I mean, I've watched a few of his videos on bench pressing, and I'm the bench press master. You know, because, you know, I, you know the guy's pretty he's decent. He doesn't strike me as a fake nanny. But why would a person, you know, who has so much, you know, I would guess you would say honor and integrity in the fitness industry do a video with the person right now who has the dark spotlight over his head. But everyone think he, you know, because come on, man. Being, it, it's like this. Does Omar really know what he's talking about? Because, you know, first of all, you would say, okay, if he's doing a video with the person who is allegedly a fake natty, does he not know that off of Destiny? You know, he has to know the buzzer on his name. He knows people calling him out. But does, but does he look at Alpha Destiny and think in his mind that Alpha Destiny is natural or not? And if so, well, shit. What does that say about his credibility, Omar's credibility as a trainer? You know what I'm saying? Because the average trainer, I can go out right now. You put 10 guys in a fucking room who lift weights, and I can tell you that one, that one, and that one all take steroids. You can just see it. You know what I'm saying? So if he does he not recognize it? 
or does he recognize it but he just doesn't give a fuck because you know even though he's not a fake natty and lying to people it's all about the paper so hey i'm willing to do whatever it takes short of taking alternative fuel sources to get them subs meaning if i gotta dance with the devil <laughs> well damn it <laughs> turn on the music <laughs> it's time to two-step <laughs> is that the situation here right now i i don't know i don't know I, you know like it, it's, it's real fucking weird you know I, that's the last collab i thought i'd ever seen in the fitness industry just like a collab with me and anybody else in the fitness industry i i thought i'd be in a fucking video with omar before alpha destiny would be <laughs> that'll never happen but anyway yeah i don't know man what's what the fuck is going on i want you guys to put your opinions down below and you guys talk it out because you already know how i feel either you know he how good is his training knowledge on spotting a fake natty or if he as he does, you know, in the back of his mind saying, yeah, I know this guy's fake, but I'm a collab with him to get them subs. Then he'll collab with him to get them subs. And, you know, doesn't mean he's going to go and agree with, with Alpha Destiny if Alpha Destiny is on some shit. But he just wants access to his subs, meaning he's going to dance for the devil to get more notoriety and more recognition for his channel. Because that's the only reason people collab anyway, is to get more subscriptions. No one ever collab because they want to just be your friend. Don't let anyone fool you with that. No one just wants to be your buddy. Hey, be a buddy. It's collab. Nah, it's never been a reason why. I mean, just come on. It's never been a reason why. <laughs> but yeah, back to, you know, Alpha Destiny being able to, not able to bench 315. Holy crap. You know, you know, Blaha right here, he's gauging how much he can bench press, but what he saw him lift in the video. That's, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. You know, especially to be promoting this badass training, you know, bear mode. I mean, I'm pretty sure a bear, if a bear can mechanically pull it off, he can bench press way more than 315 on the bench press. If a bear can actually mentally pull that off, you know what I'm saying? Can you imagine a bear with the cognitive ability to just have a seat on the bench press and grab that fucking bar and go like a real fucking bear? Yeah, and you got a guy five foot five with baby hands calling himself a bear because he has a hairy chest. <laughs> Holy shit, what is this bro going to? I don't know, man. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, you know me. <sighs> the baddest man on the planet once again hitting you guys with just real facts. Real shit. <laughs> but if you haven't already done so, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe. I'm subliminally in your mind so until next time get to the gym do work and muscle up my adversaries cry like hoes fully eradicate my foes my lyrics explode on contact came in you hoes who else but mama's only son put the phony niggas up the say my name watch bitches come now fire